with each punch and takedown. Brian Jansen is inching one step closer to achieving his goal. The 23-year-old former high school wrestler is packing his punches and hoping his ground game will lead him to victory at his debut appearance at an upcoming mixed martial arts competition in Salmon Arm. I just want to see how far I can actually go with this. So um, People say I'm good, so I want to try and flaunt it a little bit. Brian trains out of Unity Martial Arts Gym in Vernon. His coach Raja is the owner, and it was he who saw something in the former wrestler, which made him believe Brian can go all the way. When I started training with him more and more, I saw how much he was actually interested in training and not just fighting. Like, when we get a lot of guys that come down and they're like, give me a fight, you know, and he was just more like, this is fun, I like doing it. It's this passion that drove Brian to commit his time and money to the sport. And that includes a rigorous training program consisting of stretches, warm-ups, stand-up and ground techniques, as well as submissions. Been working on a little bit of everything, striking, takedowns, takedown defense. Well, you gotta keep all my pencils sharp, right? <laughs> and it's also about keeping his mind sharp. Brian is a new father who understands the competitive nature of the sport and the need to have support from family and friends to follow his dream. My wife is a uh, definite good aspect on that. I love her so much for supporting me with this whole thing. And uh, yeah, pretty much. I couldn't let my kids see me get beat up, so it's not going to happen. <laughs> I'm confident in my guy, right? Uh, but his opponent is, is a good opponent too. It's going to be a great test for him. And so I'm excited to see them get in the cage. At UCL 16, it's going to be a pretty good show. I can guarantee that. The showdown kicks off on November the 10th at 6 p.m. in Salmon Arm. For more information or to purchase tickets, visit umacvernon.com. For Go Okanagan, I'm Marianne Oakle.